all the single sailors, all the single sailors, all the single sailors, all the single sailors. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh. Hi, I'm Denise from Fleet and Family, and I wanted to talk to you about being a single sailor coming back home. Hmm. <coughs> 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 How many of you celebrated um, advancing your career during the time that you were gone? How many of you uh, started school or started working out or just made it through deployment? Whatever it is, celebrate those goals for you. Bravo Zulu! Yay! Because being out there is not easy and I know that. I usually go onto the ships so I'm missing being with you right now. Some of the things that you want to think about is that when you come back there are going to be some huge changes, more changes than usual. For you being on the ship you usually um, have isolation and you feel alone that you can't talk to anybody. Well being back on land right now because of the whole coronavirus, we are feeling what it's like to be alone. So that's not going to change a whole heck of a lot, except for you will have access to internet and you will be able to social distance and see people, which is really kind of awesome since you have been on this ship for so long. So those are some of the changes that are going to happen. Also coming back, if you have your own place, Odds are you're coming back to no ice cubes in the tray. Um, the condiments are probably six or seven months old. Um, you have to go grocery shopping again, which brings me to back to the topic of things changed a little bit while you've been gone. So you got to think about going to the grocery store, wearing a mask, um, how many items you're going to get, like meat wise, you can only get two things of meat up per shopping visit. Um, so things have really changed, um, but at least you'll be able to go shopping for yourself instead of having three square meals from the ship every single day. So you have that to look forward to. Um, some safety tips that you wanna think about when you go out. Well, first off, everybody's been wearing masks. Um, six feet distance. Um, but some other things that you might wanna think about is driving again. It's been a while since you've been driving. So if you can have someone drive for you, certainly take advantage of that. Um, maybe you haven't spoken to anybody and you're feeling a little sad or anxious about coming back. Think about talking with Fleet and Family. Um, our number is 866-923-6478. Also think about Military One Source. They have some free resources that you can actually um, order and they will come to your house to help you with relaxation. There's also apps on your phone that you will be able to utilize to help you with relaxing um, to make you feel a little bit better. Think about dating. Oh my gosh, dating. Yay, I can go dating again. Um, again, social distancing. Um, one of the things that I suggest is that if you are going to those social um, apps, wait, what is it? Swipe right, it's right. Um, swipe left, left, swipe left, and then it's not. You won't accept the date. I'm not on that app apparently. But anyway, if you decide that you want to um, go date someone, let one of your good friends know where you're going and with whom you're meeting. That's always a safety precaution. Also, when you go out to the bars, something that you might want to think about, because some of the bars are opening, not the bars are opening back up, but let's say Starbucks, you decide to go meet up there. Um, if you walk away from your drink, make sure that you test it. Um, they actually have online, and I don't know if you can see that, but they have online that you can go and get these coasters. They're... Um, 
seven for about ten dollars and you take and put your straw in the drink and then put it on the little dots and the dots say whether uh, show up whether or not um, there's a date rate drug in there or not doesn't say which kind but it does say um, let you know that there is a date rape drug in there so that might be a precaution there's also fingernail polish out that you can buy online that will when you put your finger inside of the drink if there is a drug in there it will turn the fingernail polish black so that might be something you want to think about but regardless of what you're going through thank you so much for being out there um, and you can come back and talk to somebody at Fleet and Family. Um, you can call us. You can call um, 211 to get some information. You can call Military One Source. But whatever it is, embrace the fact that you're back home. Things have changed a little bit, but you made it through this deployment. And thank you so much. Have a great Navy day.